Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to lubricate the Y-axis on Bamboo Lab A1. So if it shows on your screen that it's time to lubricate the Y-axis guide rails, you should first unplug the um, printer. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn it off at the back wait until it turns off, then I'm gonna unplug the power cable which I have right here, so I'm gonna leave it somewhere on the side. Also, for this process you will need either the authentic uh, lubricant oil that I have right here, or you can also just use the WD-40. Make sure you're using the authentic one um, because it's gonna work best. Uh, then I'm gonna flip the printer over because we need to get to the back of the printer So I'm just gonna maybe unplug the AMS at least at the back um, So I can access the back more easily And make sure that uh, the printer is disconnected from power and we all also will need uh, we'll need a cloth. Uh, the best is to use the paper towel, just something that doesn't leave fibers. Um, this is pretty important. And now we need to slide the base all the way to the front so we have access to this cover. Now I'm just gonna open it here. So here you have this little notch. You can now put it up and slide it out just like that and before we lubricate it we need to wipe off uh, the previously applied uh, lubricant if there was any so if the printer is brand new you can see there still will be something it'll be just the old oil so i'm just gonna wipe it off carefully It, it's, it doesn't leave too much of this oil, but it's great to wipe it all off. So we have it all clean and tidy. And now uh, the best is to follow the steps that I'm doing. So I'm gonna rotate the printer so you can see it better. And maybe I'll zoom in a bit. Then you should put the lubricant uh, I think I need to open it, so I'm just gonna use some knife or scissors. Okay, so I cut it open. I don't know if you can see it well. But I just need to apply it on the sides here first. So I'm gonna apply it carefully. Then you can use the other end of the tube. I'm gonna First, close it, then I'm gonna use the other end to spread it down, like that. And make sure you do it very, uh, very precisely, so you do it everywhere. And we'll need to later just repeat the process on the other side. So I'm just gonna spread it all over the sides here. I think I've done it correctly. And now I'm gonna apply it on the right side as well, or actually left because we're looking from the back. You don't need to use too much, but also use enough so, so it all covers it in that lubricant. Now I'm spreading it. And now reapply it and don't spread it. So let's apply it once again. And now we don't have to spread it anymore to apply it. 
now we should just roll the base so it lubricates it everywhere. Just gonna roll it like that a few times. Do it slowly so nothing breaks. Now I think we're all done, so I can just put the cover back on. Just slide it in. And when it's slid in, just click it here. And you can flip your printer over. And we'll need to select in the system that we have done it. So I'm gonna plug in the AMS because I've unplugged it. Then I'm gonna plug in the power cable to the printer and turn it on. Then I'm gonna click on done and it's lubricated. That's all for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you next time. Thank you.